We are here in Norway to celebrate our third exhibition in this country. We came first of all as baby artists to do Underneath the Arches of the Sonja Henge building. And then we, 10 or 20 years ago, we did a smaller exhibition with this foundation. And now we're back with our third and probably the next to the last exhibition in Oslo, the Great Exhibition. But we're very excited to make a big exhibition, museum shows. We have been doing maybe like 120 museum shows because we feel that it's one way of promoting our vision, our messages to the bigger public. And not only that, we are designing every installation ourselves from the beginning to the end. Not only we are making even the catalog page by page is designed by us in, in what called with the idea of a of uh, the public in front of us and in with invitation cards are off. Everything is based, it, it is in some way a total artwork that we are doing from the beginning to the end, it's ours. It's very important because if we leave the design of an exhibition to the director of the museum, he will choose the display of pictures and how they're hanging on the wall to suit his taste. And we believe that's wrong. When we design the exhibition, we design it with the viewer in mind. We imagine the lady coming through the door with the boyfriend or with the children, which picture they see first. We try to make a, an, an expression through the choice of pictures and where they are. It is a, a way of us reaching the public. It's not to do with our taste. It's to do with how to succeed in reaching the viewer with our thoughts and feelings through the pictures. All we have to say is come, come to the to exhibition. exhibition. This is a, it is a very rare thing to attend exhibitions of art by living artists. Most people see exhibitions of artists who have long gone. And to stand in front of a picture knowing that the person who created it is still alive is a different experience from seeing a, a work of art or a book by someone long gone. And, and so these pictures have traveled all the way here. They were in Arles, they were in other cities, and they will go on from here. But these pictures will never come back here. This is a, a unique opportunity. So the general message to all of our viewers, come to see the exhibition and ban religion and decriminalize sex. That's the two great clarion cries.